Awesome. Astero, kuda, 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 kuda. Oh, kuda, kuda, kuda. All right, guys, listen. Today, I want to try something a little bit different. Um, the plan is to come here, cook some shashlik, um, hopefully meet one or two of the locals who call this little half-populated village on the edge of the radiation zone home, and um, have a good time. All right, enough chat. Let's begin the Belarusian village barbecue party. Hoppa! <laughs> If you want to be respected as a man in the Slavic world, you have to know how to prepare a good picnic. No father-in-law will let you date his daughter if you can't cook a mean shashlik and make a decent vodka toast. So um, let me show you exactly how to do that so you can impress the ladies of the village. So I've got the charcoal in there looking good. Now I've got some magic liquid which is called Zhidkust Dlia Rojiga. Let's spray, let's pour it on. Here we go. All right then, let's light it. Oh, ребята! Super! Мне нужно помочь! Да, так, еще это надо, я думаю. О, вот, вот что я сказал. О, класс! Да, нормально? Одничанин у него. Да, да. Мы тоже пьем там, пили, добро. Конечно, мы тоже знаем, как бухать. Тоже пьем добро, Германия. Ну, наливай пару. Потому что секундочку. Мы его, он нас угощает. Хорошо. Wow, the boys are like, come on, pour some vodka, pour some vodka. They ain't got, they've got, they've got, they've got cups in the tree. What the hell? No, ладно, bloody hell! I'm being browbeaten into getting these people drunk. They're not letting me do my video. А где ты был? Он все белорусы? Да, все белорусы. Участвую. Что? Хорош, хорош. Да? Wow. Fuck. Ребята, дайте мне чуть времени, я буду это сделать, потом через 30 минут что-то вернуться, будем кушать. Полчаса. Хорошо? Полчаса. Хорошо? No. <laughs> Welcome to Belarus, where everyone just wants to have a shot of vodka. I'm now in a valley called the Pokats Valley. This is the river Pokats, here in front of my barbecue set. Now, the Pokats is a tributary of the much, much larger Soj, and the Soj flows into the Dnieper River. And it was along these waterways, these tributaries and rivers, that in the 800s, the Vikings came. They came from Sweden and sailed down in their longboats after crossing the Baltic Sea and sailed down these tributaries, forming cities and towns that would eventually become, in the late 800s, Kievan Rus. And Kievan Rus itself would go on to become Russia. So the original Russian state was a Viking state. Hey up, the boys are back in town. I told them come back in half an hour. It's been five minutes, they're already back. I wonder what they're after. All right, now I'm gonna show you the essentials that you need for a village barbecue, and that is meat, chicken, which has already been prepared in the supermarket with a nice sauce on it, some tomatoes, some, uh, what are they called? Pickled cucumbers, I think. <laughs> ah, and some um, ketchup, right then. Yep. There we go. I've got a mate now. Maybe he can hold the camera. Doug. Right then. First thing we've got to do is skewer some chicken on here. Isn't that right, matey? Isn't that right? This is how you do it. You get this. You get that. Yes. Yes. And you stick it through like that. Yeah. How's that? And you put it over the top like that. How does that look to you guys? What do you reckon? Like it. Хорошо. Да? He's impressed. I've got some tomatoes on. Let's just keep them turning. Prima. Prima Belarusia. The best Belarusian cigarettes. Prima A filter нету? Где я filter? Huh? Without filter? Здесь нету. Wow. Wow, check out this chicken though, while I'm yapping away. Давайте. These are real Belarusian cigarettes. Без These are filter. prima, no filters. I mean, look, and they come in a little wooden box, like Belarusia. a little wooden packet. Wooden packet, what's a wooden packet? Cardboard packet like this. Look at that. Belarusian cigarettes, I like it, mate, I like it. I'm almost what? tempted to have one. <laughs> I'm sure Anthony Bourdain never had these problems of having one hand to film and one hand to cook. I need a film crew. And now, no barbecue in the forest, in the village, can be complete without a little bit of vodka. 
Stograms. So um, let's pour ourselves a little vodka. Today I've gone for Dika Ochota, which yeah. means um, wild my... hunt. I'm a my wild hunt. Look, he's already he's already got the glass up. He's ready for it. As soon as I touched the bottle, his glass was in the air. I'm this guy. Can... <laughs> right, get that down, you mate. It's not going on with yourself. <laughs> there you go. Uh, maybe. Cheers. What's that of? I'm going to teach you something. Now, you may have noticed that the guy did that. Now, what does that mean? Well, in the Slavic world, in Russia, in Ukraine, in Belarus, to do that, if you do that, it means let's get pissed. Let's have a drink together. So if someone ever says, it means fancy a drink. Oh, this video is going mental. I can't get a word in. I'm trying to make like this little... I said, what's Ah, right. right. uh, he wants to take me to a shop to buy some vodka. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is art. Indeed. So, za što, ребята? Za družba. Za družba. For friendship. Let's do it. Давай. Ah, ah. Раньше было триста человек в этой деревне. А сейчас сколько? Двадцать. 20. Так где это остальное 280 люди? Где они? Не, я имею в виду, где они? На кладбище. А. Well, I reckon the chicken's ready. The guys say it's ready. <laughs> and Belarusians know about barbecue more than an Englishman, so I trust him not to kill anyone. Look, I've got one out here. Let's have a little try of it. Look at this. Get the old knife on it. Let's have a little try, see what it's like. Oh, it smells good. Vor. You're not allowed anymore. The village truck has arrived. They said that every week there's one truck comes and it brings food and stuff. And it just beeped its horn and all the villagers are going to check out what you can buy there. They're just going to see what's happening. Let's check it out. Yeah. There's no shop in the village. The shop closed down a long time ago. So these truck shops, these truck shops drive around the villages basically selling whatever you want, basically fruit, vegetables, essentials, maybe even a little bit of something. Wow. Oh. Lady at the front buying a bottle of beer. She's having a nice evening. Да, весело, да? А сейчас весело? Или не так? Сейчас мы старые, уже нам не до веселости. Не мама молодежь. Если бы молодежь была, и мы бы старые, нам бы было глядеть на их весело. Чуть-чуть скучно, наверное, сейчас, да? Жалко, жалко. Ну, у вас есть друзья, я думаю. Ну, соседи, все знают. Да, что вы соседи. Пусти, пусти, хаты, пусти. This finished barbecue isn't quite going how I was expecting. It's kind of been photobombed by these dudes. Как-то на езде. Ну, как она одна. The troublemaker's back. Осторожно, осторожно, это короче. Короче. Не надо. Ножик. Нож. Секундочку. Не надо ему нож руками пускать. Берет. Wait, there you go. <laughs> this is turning into a disaster. Secondeshku nožik ti. Secondeshku, ja dam. Sio, no. Eto nije tak prosto. No, hroše jež ni ma. Vot. Normalno? Česno? Normalno? No problem. Hey, they're saying it's all right, which means I passed the Belarusian Slav... I've got my Slavic man card, because I've cooked good... Good Slavic. Well, hey, up. We bought it. We bought it. We bought it. Bottom. Bottom. The village barbecue party is getting off now. It's starting to heat up a little bit. We're getting into the swing of it. Soon there'll be chicks turning up. I'm hoping there's some village chicks. All right. Ah, это не как пить вино в Италии. В Италии. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Через минуту уже нету. 
Две секунды. The guys are telling me that there are a lot of mushrooms growing here at this time. Um, but in this village it's okay to pick the mushrooms, but just across the river over here, the mushrooms are radioactive, so they can't pick those, they're not allowed to. But they said that babushkas still go there and pick them sometimes and eat them. Um, babushkas here are hardcore, they don't care about radiation and stuff like that. Давайте за наши встречи тогда. Было неожиданно? Но было хорошо. Очень приятно. Приятно. Приезжайте хоть и кожен день. Спасибо. Мы против будем и ознакомимся с вами. Будет отлично. Спасибо. Хорошо, давайте. Я раскрыться. Давай, пить. Хорошо. Виталий знает, где это. Осторожно, бада там. Осторожно, куда, 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 куда? О, куда, куда? Куда? Направиться куда? надо. Хорошо, все хорошо? Туда. Кто? Осторожно, тихонько. А мы добрые же люди. Очень добрые. Спокойные. Добрые, хорошие люди. Совсем не агрессивные. Да. И это, да, это так большой жал для меня что ну, всегда проблем в Беларуси это между большой страной Россия и Германия. Это проблем. Из этого страдали да. всегда белорусские а люди. Кто? Something I have to teach you is about making a toast. When you go to a party in Belarus and you're drinking vodka, at some point you're going to have to make a toast. And so it's a bit nerve-wracking for a foreigner because in our countries, or in England at least, we don't make toasts, we just say cheers. So always be prepared for a toast. You will be judged by the goodness or the quality of your toast. I'm being attacked by mosquitoes. So always have one ready. Now a simple one is to make sure that you always get the third toast. The third toast in Belarus is always Zalubov, to love. Zalubov. So if you get the opportunity and you don't feel comfortable making a toast in front of everyone, just say, make sure you grab the third one. Just say, давай, ребята, за любовь. Oh! Oh! Well, that's the end of the video. Um, it was an experiment. I'm not sure how it went. I'm not sure if I'll ever do another one of these. It's not easy. It's not easy being a chef when you've got a camera in one hand and just one hand to do stuff. It was interesting though.